so welcome to ko tutorials so let's continue with the next part of this tutorial so let's get started so as you can see over here we have started with the texturing of this particular game environment that's a game asset and environment so let's continue it so now what i'll be doing over here i'll be texturing this few of the things over here so let's select this let's go into the material editor let's open material editor send a vray take a vray material let's go into this and i'll go into this bitmap and i'll and let's go into this texture stuff over here so i'll just go into this and i'll take this uh, metal texture over here so let's assign a metal texture so again i'll go into this let's go over here and let's give a uvw map set it as a box uvw map set it as a box we can just assign this assign this set it as a box again go into this let's go into this give vray bump to normal and let's connect it with a bump map go into this bit map and let's assign this in this way similarly the same way now select this then let's again go over here take a vray material and let's go into the bitmap let's again go over here i'll just assign some texture over here so i'll just assign this concrete over here for it and let's go over here and let's set it as a box i can slightly add a bit of roughness to it and again i'll go into this let's add a vray bump to normal and go into this let's add this again select this we'll be adding the same metal over here in this way so select this i'll just delete this this is not required so let's go over here let's go into photoshop i'll just open one texture over here again i'll go into this select this let's give unwrap uvw so i'll just unwrap this quickly now select the 
polygons from the top quick planner map quick planner map select this whole thing and again I can just go into this if you want you can just give a cut over here or I can just give quick peel over here so go into this say pack UVs over here render UV template and let's just save this over here I'll just name it as UVs so let's go into Photoshop I'll just open this UVs over here <coughs> right click layer via copy and let's just drag this you can just resize it again I can just make a copy of it if required I can just select this merge this both fill over here and let's give content aware so I can slightly resize it if required so again go over here let's take uh, ellipse over here layer via copy and again just drag it it's very close that's the reason if you want you can again separate it going in uh, the software and you can do that go to the main layer layer via copy and again drag it in this way <coughs> so let's just close this let's go into this file save as and let's save it in barrel or drum you can name it anything over here so let's go into this go into the material and let's take a v-ray material over here let's go into diffuse go into bitmap and just select this assign the material over here perfect so and isolate it you can slightly rotate it over here if required so I can just delete this and I can make the multiple copies over here again I can just duplicate it <coughs> in this way that's it so let's just save the file once again over here for it we do have the tires and all this stuff over here as well 
let us select this. Let us assign the same color over here. Select this and let us go into this. Go into diffuse bitmap. So, I will assign this concrete over here that is the broken concrete kind of stuff looks better now. So, oops I will first ungroup this then I will assign this and let us go into this say UVW map go into the material. this is ok yeah this looks much better <coughs> again i'll go over here bump to normal i'll add it connect it with a bump map bit map and let's add this over here as well and let's give it as over here we have assigned 3 by 3 that is for roughness similarly we can add it over here as well and for this we will just assign a metal over here set it as a UVW map over here for this we can again give the <coughs> metal stuff uvw map can set it as a box again go into this set it as a box So, we do have some window section over here as well. So, I will just take a copy of it. Let us just assign it wherever it is required. Slightly shuffle this out so I can just shuffle it in this way drag it up in this way again just all right so guys if any doubts please put it in the comment section over here so please like and subscribe my youtube channel if you're not subscribed yet so, we will continue the rest of the part in the coming tutorial. So, thanks for watching this tutorial.